Nebraska and Michigan State. How did the Spartans lose this game, Chris? I, honestly, I'm not sure. They, they, had a, they were up by two scores for most of the second half. Tommy Armstrong Jr. with the touchdown pass here. So Nebraska up 10-0. Things looking pretty good for the Cornhuskers, but back come the Spartans, third and fourth. What a move there. And he is gone. Michigan State taking or tying it at 10 apiece. It's now 13-10. Michigan State into the end zone. Connor Cook with another touchdown pass. That's to Kings Jr. And this, this is it. This is it. Up five, Nebraska trailing. That's a touchdown. But wait, he came in from out of bounds. You can't do that. That comes off. So they review it. I don't even know what they really decided. He, he was they, clearly out of bounds. They gave him the touchdown. Here's Michigan State, seven seconds left, almost right. in field goal range. Just spike it. He throws it out of bounds, but it took too long. Game over. Wow. You know what? It's about time Nebraska ended up on the right end of one of these because they have lost so many games like this just this season. Remember BYU beating them on the last play? Oh, Miami. I mean, just Hail Mary. crazy stuff has happened. So Michigan State's first loss of the season happens tonight. That means that three of the four longest winning streaks in college football to begin the day have now been snapped. Michigan State, Memphis, and TCU. All of those teams were unbeaten. All of them have lost.